Hello and welcome back. Right, we have lots and lots of work to do. We do. We have got plenty to be doing. Yes, all those massive, massive yeah, batches of stuff we've got to get sorted. Now, I seem to recall, did I fill this and... I did. That is the job we've got to do. So let's run this across. We aren't going to need that at the minute, that mower. Though I'm hoping we do in a couple of days. Yes, I think this is a good idea. I do. I was, yeah, I was a bit unsure. I'm so chuffed though. I, I do apologise as well. I must have, I, I mistook the planting for the harvest and the harvest for the planting. And it was only yesterday when the, the truth <laughs> literally hit me and I thought, no, no, you're fine. But I, mind you, it was a good feeling. Ooh, it's a really a bit unstable. I don't know if it's. I've never had this problem with any other tractor. Maybe it's me being a bit too tight. It might be yeah, too tight a turn. It could well be. Yeah, concentrate on the task at hand. It could be also a little bit high on this tractor. Right, okay then. So, we are going to need to you know, put the fruit box as well, which is where... Where have we stuck the fruit box? It's over there. Right, okay, so we're going to need to get that out of it, drop that into the uh, silo. Yep. Smash it, perfect time. Yeah, that's what you're going up there anyway, so let's take it. Yeah, I'm hoping we don't tip that over again. Just, yeah, I'm wondering if it is this. I've never had the HTZ with this before. Was a bit bigger, whether it's the I do love um, articulated tractors, I think they are absolutely amazing. But yeah, there's always slight bad things as well. Everything's got a, a plus and a minus, so it could be that that's the minus. Let's switch that engine off, it does drive me crazy. Right, so front box. Ah, there's some seed as well. We'll grab that as we pass. Yeah, I am going to go into a time lapse. I am. Oh, yeah, because this isn't gets us a biggie. Hopefully, that will mean that we can now do the potatoes. Yeah, the uh, washed potatoes. I forget what the production calls them, but yeah, they are washed potatoes. And you get more for those than you do for the uh, from the chips or French fries. Yes. And then we need to open that up. Nope. To. Yes, that's exactly it. Not sure how much we've got there, and we don't want grass. Yes, we do. <laughs> we do actually. That I remember. I deliberately left that. Deliberately, because yes, of me making a mistake. That was a very wise decision of the the past me for the future me or the present me. Actually, yes, I know myself only too well. Yes, I've come in at this at an angle, because every time I come from it down the thing, of course, it's wrong. Now, we do have some seeds in here, I seem to recall. Yes, oh, oh that's too far. Let's get this as good as it can be. Right, so we'll just get that back filled completely. Ooh. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's a shame about not receiving any money for uh, the trees on this uh, map. Yeah, oh, you do have to open it like that. You do it three times. God, mate, come on, what am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong? Lower, turn on. Unload. No, I want to undo the... It really does. 
Is it because I've got the front box on? Sometimes mods upset each other. You know, it gives you doesn't give you options that you normally can do. Change. What's that? I'm on the tractor. Don't select toggle change. It's a ridge marker. Brilliant. Okay. Ah. Oh. Oh. Nice one. <laughs> so ah. Oh. No, no, no. What's it? To... Oh, okay. Yeah. This is this is getting silly now. Let's just just shut the bridge marker. And you see now that does shut it. You know, only could I faff around like this and make filling up a thing look difficult. <laughs> it's, I do have this ability, I really do. So we've got four tons, we should have more than enough to plant enough, yeah, all that we've got to do. But as I say, it is, it's a big one now. Let's have a look at contracts. Have we had any contracts drop? I doubt it, it's literally been minutes, but yeah, let's do new ones. No, nothing there. I didn't think there would be, but you never know. They can drop in the afternoon. I have known this before on other maps. Right, yeah, it's good. This is a bit scuddy, this tractor. It's very heavy and sometimes it requires quite a lot to get it shifted. It's not me. Right, I am going to say my words because we have a lot of work to do. So, now then, that is a point. I could be getting my little tractor going because I seem to recall. I'm hoping the data has been good to us this time. And it's remaining. Yes. Liming. Yeah. And yeah, mainly liming though. Right. Let's get the little one going because we're going to be taking control of that one. The, the big one that is. Not the little one. Right. Come on, let's have that for the moving there. This is definitely fantastic. It does. I use this on my Hobo Solo, and you did get money for that. It is this map, definitely. I do like it though. It's definitely a fantastic thing that I am going to use going forwards as, as my Unreal Tree Devour. On for normal trees. If I'm going to do logging proper forestry, though, I am going to do it properly. It's only because game mechanics are so awful. They really are, and I, I, I speak from experience, having done an awful lot of normal trees on Hobo Solo to the extent that, yeah, boy, is it, it was hard work. It was, and the, also, I got the chipper, and I gave that a genuine try as well. That was just as absolutely awful it was. It was so stressful, it didn't work right. I was throwing logs in, and the, the chipper was throwing the logs back out. So it was like, yeah, it was... Point. We've got the front. Yeah, we're going to have to do this. Yeah, adjust the back. I seem to recall we have actually got some lime in. I'm not sure in editing I remember seeing 2000 something or not. Yeah. Okay, okay. You have got some arrows on. I do remember that. Let's set this go. Ooh, sorry, cars. Yeah, that was a bit bad of me. Right, we're going to be filling this up forever, though. You know, I think what we're going to do, you can always do, they are very reasonable. We are, I know it's, we're trying to save money, but mind you, I suppose we could lease one. Well, I think that's what we'll do. We shall lease a second one because they are going to be pennies or pound dollars, euros even. I will get this right. Which reminds me, I'm quite sure. I'm probably not on Euros. I'm probably on... Oh, okay. I know I am. Right. Let's get that out of the way because we're blocking the roads. Sorry, cars. Right, I am going to say my words. We're going to rinse and repeat this. We are going to lime and we are going to seed. And, yeah, this is going to take some time. So, yeah. Ooh. So, I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side.
think that will do us. It's not perfect, but it is good. It's yeah, yeah. It's it is pr slight problems with the uh, Zeta. I knew it would be. Obviously, it's a small back. The uh, AC. The AC2 has only got a small capacity, it can have more than this 2600 but then I think the Zeta would struggle a bit so it's a trade off, uh, that we knew this would be a, a difficult, this is not my normal let's play, this, there's going to be lots of constraints, lots of difficulties caused by equipment that's not quite right because I've got to do it cheaply so yeah, it is not, it's, gonna be, it's not going to be uh, pleasant for me in a lot of sort of situations. I think we've planted everything, we're going to have a quick look when we get back to the fields, we should get the water across to the uh, thing. We also might get the, I'm going to check prices for um, what we have got uh, in, which is sorghum, yeah, sorry, mind went blank, not which it was, I was trying to think quickly, but yeah, on the sorghum. Because obviously we can't wait till the perfect time, we've got to sell them at the very best that we can possibly get them, so the grain exporter on this map seems to be well above what you would expect, which is obviously for us very good. Did I pH this field? I don't think I did, did I? No I didn't, let's do that. Let's be thorough. In fact, I think we can set a work going on this one. As soon as we go after the grass. Not that I think line will last very long, but at least we can probably get the water across there. Right, let's just grab that then, of course. It is 1942 meter. Clear. Load. Activate. At all, I want. Right, let's grab the water, take that across. We might go grab the uh, the man. I might have to take trailer fill limit off because, yeah, it, even though it is, it's, it's 10 ton limit, but it does, yeah, it does definitely. Uh, I seem to recall I had problems on the old stream farm. I did have the mams for a little while, but yeah, they were so. But on this we may, yeah, we've got to pull every every single trick in the book for this particular one. Not cheating, I'm not talking about cheating, but... Oh, not again. It has got to be this tractor. Yeah, it has. We already know from the last video that there's no way I can actually pop this. I've tried it for ages. I don't believe that. I've never, ever had this do this to me before. I just, yeah, you just can't. Try one thing. Right, let's go grab that. Yeah, oh, do you know, I hate this. I mean, I, that I didn't expect, I've got to be honest. Yeah, I really did not expect to be facing that kind of problem. Not... Wow, that didn't last very long. Mind you, it doesn't, does it though? That is the point. Yeah, it is from yellow, so almost no lime to heavy lime, so yeah, it didn't last long. Oh, I can't believe the HTZ, it doesn't look that high either. The, uh, but I haven't had any problems with any other tractor with the Nielsen tank, and I have actually used it quite a lot now. Yeah, Star is all sorts of tractors. Never had a problem, never once dropped it over, and that particular patch isn't that bad. I understood down where we had difficulties the other day, but not there. It, it's, it's fairly flat. Unless it Unless it, yeah, I suppose it could have actually gone down. Thinking about it in a different place, I'm gonna to have to check and edit it just to see if it is totally my my fault, or whether it really is just HTZ thing. I'm trying to stick course play so that everything's yeah, you can't see all the lines now. I'm trying to be 
little bit better. I'm trying to see if I can push that onto because this accepts liquids. I'm not sure if it accepts water, but if it does, look, we can push that onto the actual. Then we might have a chance because once that's not got fluid in it, it is possible to do all sorts of things to it. So let's see if we can push it a little. I tried this the other day, but it was not having any of it onto the. Yeah, it gets stuck. Wow. Let's just see if we can give a good bash. Now technically that to me looks very much like it should be. Well, am I? No, oh, yeah, yeah, I am. And yes, definitely, I'm in the right place. Oh, that definitely is. No, it's not liking that. It's Game mechanics are absolute babes sometimes, really are. Because obviously we are right over where we should be. And with that weight in this, there's not a cat in. I'm not going to say that. Yeah, it will not. It, it goes too high. They, I mean, this is a heavy tractor as well. I mean, well heavy. It's not having any of it. I don't know how the engine's going on that because it's got no power. I mean, that's the entire reason for having going on this. Yeah, I'm not sure what to say on this because this is a game's mechanic glitch. And as much as I hate using super strength, to be honest, I think for once, as much as I do, and I really do detest this, you, this probably will be the first time you will have seen me use super strength. I do, yeah, I know other content creators, some are terrors for using super strength, but it's not, I like it to be as realistic as possible, but this is down to, yeah, oh wow, I can't see a thing, yeah, game mechanics, I'm going to rotate that if it will let me, Whoa. nearly, And it isn't just the money thing, because we can afford the, um, we've, we did it before, but we, you can't do this every single time we move the water. I'm gonna, it's, and we can't just sell our tractor and get another one, either. It's, uh, Gordon Bennett, that's well difficult. It's just impossible to sort of do that kind of thing. It's... Great, so what on earth have you done? Why has it shoved it right the way over there? Like I can get that. Ridiculous. It's not like 
me grab it. Yeah, as I did find on uh, one of the other Let's Plays, it is super strength, but it's not Superman strength. Yeah, it really is. Uh, that's a bit, a bit far back. Let's see if we can get to it. I do apologise, I absolutely detest using super strength, but this is, it's a bit silly. It, uh, yeah, I, I don't mind. But it's doing things it shouldn't really be doing. It's, it's going to be awful as well. The weight ratio is really bad. It's all going to be at the back. Let's see if we can... Uh, let's watch this carefully as well. It does bank way too much. Maybe the articulation. Maybe that. I don't think I've used an articulate tractor with this. Perhaps it's not. It is also high. I can see that. This is the bit where it is dangerous, where you go in. Yeah, we're going to need to like come at this straight, going down the hill straight rather than go at angles. Yeah, like sort of that. Let's just watch it carefully. Yeah. Yeah, this is it. Is you can see the angles on it though. It's not pleasant. Feel that while that's doing that. Not got much more to do on this now, thank goodness. Wow, we get through lime something like something chronic. Well, I nearly done though, yeah. I would say one more. You've got to do the job properly if you're gonna do it. It does pay off. These are the corners I'm not willing to cut, so that's the lime and the fertilizer. Yeah, these are the things that do I, I'm not Rolling's bad enough, but 2%, I can live with that 2%. When you start to get 35 and 50% and bonuses like that, yeah, and deficits, yeah, it's just not worth it. Yeah, the hit's too great, and we're all about trying to get the best we can, so let's finish this one. I do realise why the worker was getting through lime. It wasn't that it wasn't that it was get, well. It was getting through the lime, but once it got through the back box, it could not. Yeah, it couldn't. I, I found myself when I did it manually. It could not actually um, use the front box, which is why I swapped it, took it off, because it was just wasting three tons of lime with each pass. So it would take ages to say it was tanks full because it was crawling along the ground very slowly looking at what happened to me. Right, let's have a look then. Let's have a look. So not bad. So I say there's a couple of little... Some of that, that, that 14 is actually down to soil type. But that little blob there and those couple of triangles at the top, that's obviously the grass that we've sown. I am not on... I am a little unhappy about that, but... Ah, nitrogen. Now we could get that done. Oh, and this one. Yeah, that's the one thing we're going to do, because nitrogen is not like... Ah, we've actually got some nitrogen as well. Let's get that from the back. Yeah, we'll get the new grass done. The little tiny strips, they're difficult to do, though. Yeah, thinking about those, how we attack them. I know we can alter this spread rate, but even that, I don't know that we can quite do it to that extent, so, 
Yeah, I just want to get all the jobs out of the way. It's, it's, it is, I've got to be honest, it is a, a real slog. It is. It is for myself, and I must say it probably is, but it is a story in so much as... Yeah, it, I can't do anything about it. It is one of those things that if we're following this storyline, and you would be fighting for your life, then, yeah, you would do whatever you needed to... Oh, OK. Ah, so... Is that auto? Yeah. Oh, wow, that's awful. Precision farming doesn't seem right. Right, let's let's open the thing. We need to change the width now to. No, it's that one. No, it's not. Change width. width. Oh, it's right. Say. Yeah, I would say 18 is not far off. Let's get this done, let's get that edge of that grass done. The new grass and the top bit as well. Yeah, it is as well. They've changed grass. Grass used to be the one that was bright green. I mean, absolutely bright green, so... did say this the other day on the uh, I did notice the day after the update that it literally had there's a lot of mini updates um, going on or there were uh, just before the weekend and I noticed the very first session because I was on greenings that my grass had gone from a lovely green to a horrible orangey green We're better than this though I don't know if this is soil type or whether it's map or what but this still looks even worse than it did on greenlands really totally Awful. Right. Do we pass down on the right? Let's narrow and then we'll widen there again, I think. Yeah, I'm glad we got rid of that tree and we got rid of that other tree. I am keeping the weeping willow though. You don't they are it's a beautiful tree. I am keeping that down the side. It's it's tough. If I got if it's gonna cause me issues, it's gonna cause me issues, but yeah, I want to have a little tiny bit of fun though at the end of this. I would like to get to April. We don't seem to have any contracts coming through now, so literally once we've done the nitrogen in here, we really are, we've done as much as we can. We've done all the grass, all the ploughing, nitrogen in, pH. I've done the pH on this, but oh, that's true. Lime is a bad one actually too. It's not awful. Yeah, it is. It is. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna lime it. I will get another tub of lime, and we'll see how far we get. I'm not willing to take a hit on this type of thing. This is the entire point. As horrible as it is, and it is horrible. That's it. Oh, this, this is better than lime for not losing. Oh, I've seen a bit there that I missed. I was trying to be really thorough, but there's a yeah, there's a patch there that's not going to grow grass. Typically. Right, let's do that top patch. See what I mean about how large they are, though? They are fields. That's why I thought, when I saw this, I thought, this is just too much of a thing for us to miss. It did throw course by a wobbler though because because the edges are there's different crops and there's a lot of growing on yet yeah, it saw it all as one giant field so I'm hoping once the grass has grown that that's otherwise we're going to be using standard workers the entire through the entire let's play because yeah course blades I, th I can't remember I, I had a similar problem to this on no man's land um, on the last field I bought and again it was I know I can manually run a course, that would be the one way that I could fix it, where you actually literally run a field edge and you call it a specific course name, so there, there are ways around it, and if we did have to do that, I would do that myself off camera, because yeah, that's the type of job that really is not the one that I want you to be looking at. There are some jobs that even I realise that are just too, too much for anyone. Right, let's have a look how that looks on the... 
Yeah, you wouldn't know we'd done it. Look at the difference between the orange and the orange. That's horrible. Right. That's, yeah, actually that is a point. Let me... Let's go to the minimum. Oh, it's 15. Yeah, 15 metres. So we've got to go down the edges of this. We'll use all that we've got if we have to, going down all the sides, but... We may as well. We have got it. We'll do the best we can. It might not be doing an awful lot, but... Does it say perfect? Yeah, it does, actually. So, yeah, that's, I'm happy with that. Yeah, I'm keeping that tree. It's, yeah, it's. I do love the weeping well, I don't see them that often in Britain. When I was a kid, you used to see quite a lot of those, but it became less popular, I think. I don't know they're harder to grow or keep or whatever, but. Yeah, I think they're a beautiful tree. Yeah, I mean, look, this is another patch. I mean, obviously, we did do the roads. We've converted the roads to. Well, it would have been a dirt path, so it's not really beyond the uh, realms of possibility but it is it was on our back so we were allowed to do that. Or well, it would in real life as well so yeah it's not like we were uh, taking liberties. So we've got the edge of the, we have down the edge of 14 as well, haven't we? Quickly go do that and then we'll grab the, the lime. It is a long session. It is, this is going to be another monster, but I'm, most of it's going to be time lapse. But nah, it's a little bit busy. sessions actually. Yeah, this corner, there is a slight patch, I might actually um, put some paint on that, so that edge is, yeah, it went, it's weird how one implement allows you to rip something up, but then another one won't. I mean, I knew it was on the edge of our, edge of our land, it just won't let me touch it, so. No, we must have caught that one somehow. Does this go? It doesn't. Ah, it's not done the data, that's why. Yeah, that's still wrong. If you look at that, the nitrogen, we've scanned these fields. This map is definitely not quite right. Because that I've scanned that. You can't have the pH showing the entire field and then have the nitrogen only showing you patches when you scanned the same field. So it definitely is wrong. It's something not quite right with the map. It, it, that's the price you pay for adopting a map early. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not got any data. No, right. I can't do it for that bad then. Now that's one thing about when you have precision farming on, but it won't go back to just throwing it out. It sort of switches it off, and that, in my opinion, at that point, you should still be able to manually take it. Oh, can I? That's true, I really can. If I knock it off all the time, it's going to be yeah, a can. It's big. At least we've done almost our best. Yeah, there's a, that little a bit of not doing that up there. And then there is, obviously, we're going to pH. Around the edge of the field. This is probably not going to. The thing is, it will cost you more 
if you don't do it because you know how to pay for it in lost yield. So, yeah, it's. That's why I always do it after each. Yeah, after each sort of go. That way it, it goes from dark green to a lighter green and it only takes a tad. You see, look how we're getting through that. Even with that little spread. It's wide though, that's what I'm saying. That is only just going over there. That's 15 metres. And there's more. That's more like 18 metres. So actually there. So that it's definitely worth us doing this, even though it is an absolute backbreak. It really is. I think I've ever oh, why is that? It likes it low when it's got weight in and it likes it high when it hasn't. over the road. I reckon that's going to take nearly a full one. Look at how much we've done on that little tiny bit. Yeah, I think that's true. I'm going to go into a time lapse because this is, again, I would say this is going to take a while. So, I am going to say my words. I see you guys and gals on the other side.
we go. I think that is us completely done now. Gordon Benny, that took some doing. Wow, did it. This is a killer in the job. It is, I've got to be honest, it's, it's, this has been probably my greatest challenge to date. Yeah, I'd also... My gut says I'm not sure whether I'm going to do this or not. It is a massive undertaking, even pulling out every single sort of trick that I know. I'm still you know, not 100% sure I'm going to pull it off. Even with all we did. We also seem to be having our fair share of problems. So, <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Right, okay then, now we need to be looking at productions, yeah, I want to be checking out if the washed potatoes, yeah, that one, it's, yeah, we've got 300, again, I'm still not sure whether they've gone wrong on this, I'm really not, French fries premium, ah, here we go, we need to be doing those as well, selling, smashing, and that is, yeah, that's all we've got. There is nothing else that we've got going in there. And as I said, the thing is with this, right, yeah, that is it. Let's also look at what to see Sorg and what sort of price are we? 1262. Now that is a very good price. I think we're gonna do that. We'll go grab the are we easy to lease? No, we're not. Do you know? No, I'm not. This is for next session. We will go and grab the trailer though from the uh, yard and we'll see if it does do the trailer feel of it. What we will do. Oh no, we can't. Yeah, I was, I was wanting really to see the growth in the morning, but you know, this is what I keep saying. This is 4.15 and it's on real time. So this has been a full day from 9 till 4, a full proper day of me working in these fields. And there was some time that was like 0 0.5 times that, yeah, I didn't mean to, but I realised there was a few times I was starting off talking and then I did a bit of work and it was still on 0 0.5. So this has been a, a full day's work, literally. So, yeah, there's been quite a few sessions to achieve that. But it really has literally been, you know, the full day. Yeah, we're going to see if this trailer fill limit is, whether it'll let me do 10 tons or whether it will. Yeah, we may, may need to switch that off. I'm sure it, it, last time I looked it was something like 4.5 tons. It actually says on that, yeah, it does 4.5 tons on the back of the thing, so I think we're going to have to switch it off for this we'll go on what it says on the tin rather than yeah not oh it's actually off anyway right smash it so this should give us a 10 ton so we're going to need to do four and a bit trips tomorrow to the Korean export which is a fair own trek but this is what I was saying this is what we've got to do to actually get this it's a million million euros we need to pay back and we've only got till the turn of from August to September it's only half a year there's only a, le a maximum of two cuts we've got on the grass and also as I said it's also about getting the outputs of the productions before the turn of that. It's no good with sticking grass in the night on August because turn of 12 o'clock in the morning then yeah whatever it is is there's nothing more to do so we could have products still in the production and it's not going to make it the slightest bit of difference so Should actually be able to get ten tons. That is true. Smashing. 
tentacles. Right, and that is where we're going to leave it then, Venus. We've got to do that. That is what we're going to have to do. It really is. It's, yeah, it is, it is what it is. This is going to be one of the most skimpiest equipment cost Let's Plays I think I've ever done. Whether it's, yeah, we're going to have very little equipment on the ground. But we literally do with like a skeleton crew and leasing and all sorts to make this work. So, right, yeah, we're going to leave it there. It has been a monster session. So, I hope you're going to stick with me on this. It is, I, I, I know it does require a bit of patience, but it is, I, it, I've got to go with the, the story is realistic. If you were battling for your life, you would literally get every last little ounce out of the day. Have we got any contracts? No, we have not. Okay, so, I don't think any more are going to drop this late in the day. But we have done everything we have done. That is a good place to be. It's taken me sessions to get there, but we have planted all of our fields and we will be able to harvest them in time. So the only thing is obviously we are going to be stuck with whatever price we get at the turn of, yeah, let's look at when we actually harvest. We harvest... We may be lucky we might get June. We did plant early, but we might not. If it's July, if and if wheat is August, that we are gonna be way too close and we are gonna be at the however the prices are in August and September for those which are quite low. That is what we're stuck with. So this is what we're fighting. We really are. It's not good. It really isn't. Of course, we're on normal economy. We're not on easy. So this is... Prices are not fantastic. Potatoes. Yeah, that's the only thing I am unsure of is whether potatoes have gone funny in the production. I did have this on another map where, this, where I had problems with soil. Yeah, literally that's... Uh, I put straw in that and it would not go down. So, yeah, I mean, there's again, there's nothing I can do about that. Maybe that offsets some of the terrible bad luck we've had with trees that aren't selling. We would have, I'm quite sure, made 20,000, 30,000 out of that. Yeah, and we've lost all sorts of weird and wonderful things. As I said, me using super strength, that's, that's unheard of. I don't do that. But if that's going to keep rolling off all of the time... Yeah, well, I have to be careful when I do use that though, because it isn't that. I don't. I think it must be the articulation. It must be flipping that and causing issues. So I think I'm going to have to drive straight down at it and make up for that. Otherwise, it's going to be a nightmare. Anyway, I am going to say my goodbyes. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye for now. <laughs>